with multiple choice questions from my answer page 112. Look at with me about question number one. The prime number has these factors. The prime number has two factors. Any prime number has only two factors, can divide it by itself and one only. Question number one, we have two prime factors, such as that two, three, five, seven. Okay. The smallest prime number is what? The smallest prime number, it will be two. Choose letter C. Question three. The smallest odd prime number is three. Smallest odd prime number is three. Choose letter C. Question four. Space is the only even prime number. Two is the only even prime number. Choose the letter C. Question number five. The number eleven has space factors have two factors. Number eleven has two factors. Okay, because eleven we call it prime number. The prime number has only two factors. Can divide it by itself and one only. Eleven can divide it by itself and one only. We have two factors. So the number eleven has two factors. Question number six. The prime number between forty four and fifty. Forty four and fifty. Forty one. 42, okay, 41, 42, 43, okay, 43, it's prime number, 44, no, 45, no, 46, no, because 46 is even, 47, yes, okay, choose the letter C, we have 47 is the space, it's question 6, question 7, 2, 5, and 7 are prime factors of what? Multiplication all factors here to find the number you must find the product of two prime factors two five and seven two times five equal ten ten times seven equals seventy so the number here will be seventy choose the letter D about question seven question number eight three two and seven are prime factors of what? 3 by 2 by 7. 3 times 2 equals 6. 6 times 7 equals 42. Question number 9. The prime factors of 18. 18 equals 2 times 9. And 9 equals 3 times 3. 2 and 3 and 3. Choose the letter B about question number 9. Question 10. The prime factors of the number 28 are, we know, 28 equal 4 times 7, and 4 equal 2 by 2. Then, 2 times 2 times 7. Choose the letter P. Question 11. Which of the following is a prime? The prime number has only two factors, can divide it by itself and one only, such as that 2, 3, 5, 7. So the result here will be 3. Choose the letter P. 1, not prime number, because 1 can divide it by itself only. 9, not prime number, because 9 can divide it by itself and 1 and 3. It has three factors. 9 can divide it by 9, 9 can divide it by 1, 9 can divide it by 3. So 9 has 3 factors, 15 not a prime, not a prime number, because 15 can divide it by 15, can by, divide it by 1, divide it by 3, divide it by 5, has 4 factors, 4 prime factors, okay, so it's not prime number. Question 12, which of the following is composite number? Composite is meaning not prime, which number here not prime, 33. 33 can divide it by 3. 31 can divide it by itself. Oh, the following is a composite. Can you tell me the composite number here? About which one? 12. Letter C. 33, we call it composite. 
شو ذا ترسي وش هم شرتين وش اوف ذا فولوينج از نوت ا برايم نمبر نوت ا برايم نمبر ات ويل بي 9 شو ذا تر دي بيكوز 9 كان ديفايد باي اتس سيلف اند 1 ان 3 وش هم 14 اول ذا فولوينج نمبرز ار كومبوزيت اكسبت وات وش نمبر هير وي كولد ات برايم ويل بي 67 67 نوت ا برايم نمبر 67 We call the composite because we sixty seven here not composite. We call that prime number. Sixty seven can divide it by itself and one only has only two factors. Can divide it by itself and one only. Question number fifteen. Which statement is true? Question fifteen. Letter A. One is a factor of only odd numbers. One is a factor. Of only odd numbers, no, odd and even. Any numbers can divide by one. Letter B. One is not a factor of any number. It's false because any number can divide by one. Then one is a factor of any number. Letter C. One is a factor of every number. C. Yes, it's true. Choose letter C. D. One is a factor of only D. Only zero. No, any numbers can divide by one. Question sixteen. Look at with me about question 16 here and pay attention about this example. Okay. What is the best explanation for the difference between a prime and the composite numbers? Letter A. A prime number has only two factors, one and itself. A composite number has more than two factors. It's true. Choose letter A about question 16. Choose the third E. Question 17. The graceful factor of 65 and 7. We have here 7 and 56. 56 can divide by 7. Then the graceful factor it will be what? It will be 7. Because 56 can divide by 7. 7 times 8 equals 56. Choose the letter C. Question 18. The graceful factor of 10 and 15, 10 and 15 can divide it by 5. Then, the common factor between two numbers here it will be what? It will be 5. Understood? 10 and 15, the greatest common factor, it will be 5. It's the height common factor between two numbers. Two numbers can divide it by 5. It's the greatest number. Or you can write 10, equal 5 times 3, and 15, uh, 10 equal 5 times 2, and 15, 5 times 3. The common factor between them, it will be 5. Question 19, the greatest common factor of 7 and 5, this common factor between them it will be one we have here two prime numbers the greatest common factor between any two relative prime numbers or any two prime numbers it will be one only so the greatest common factor between two numbers here it will be one now it's question 19 choose the letter c question 20 the greatest common factor of 20 and 30 we can find what greatest common factor it will be what it will be 10 understood we know 20 equal 2 times 2 times 5 and 30 equal 2 times 15 and 15 equal 2 times 5 equal 10 10 times 3 equal 30 and we can choose one digit from common numbers here the common numbers here will be 10 okay which and 21 the common factor of all numbers is 1 the common factor of 
one number is one question 22 one and seven are the cool factors of space one times seven equals seven and we can choose what seven and fourteen question 22 choose the third d one times seven equals seven and fourteen can divide by seven choose seven and fourteen Next question, question 23. Which pair of numbers has the same greatest common factors as 42 and 12? 42 and 12 here. Which pair of numbers has the same greatest common factor? The greatest common factor between 42 and 12 42 can't divide by 12 but 42 equal 6 times 7 7 times 2 times 3 and 12 equal 6 times 2 right 2 times 3 times what 2 times 3 equals 6 6 times 2 equal 12 we can draw here and there is a greatest common factor between two numbers 2 times 3 will be 6 so the greatest common factor between 2, 42 and 12, it will be 6. Now, in this example, I want to choose what two numbers. I will choose 18 and what 18 and 30. Because the greatest common factor between them, it will be 6. Why? Because 18 equal, 18 equal what? Can you tell me? 18 equal 6 times 3, I will solve it up, okay, to know the steps. We want to find the greatest common factor between 18 and 30 up here, okay. We know 18 equal 3 times 6, and 6 equal 2 times 3, and 30, 3 times 10, 3 times 2 equal 5, 5, 3 times 2 equal 6, 6 times 5, by 30 then the greatest common factor between them it will be 3 times 2 equals 6 so you must choose here about question 23 choose letter D question 24 two groups took public Transportation in Sharm el Sheikh, each ticket costs the same amount of money. One group spent 16 Gypsy Lira and other and the other group spends 12 Gypsy Lira. Or at most, how much does the greatest possible cost each ticket? Hint use guess con factor. Okay. We can use the greatest common factor between two numbers, 16 and 12. We, call, we can write here 16 equal 2 times 8, and 8 equal 2 by 4, and 4 equal 2 by 2. That's 16. And the next number here, we have 12 equal 2 times 6, and 6 equal by 3 and then we can write here 16 equal 2 by 2 by 2 by 2 and then we can write 12 equal 2 by 2 by 3 draw the circles here to write what the greatest common factor between them it will be 2 by 2 it will be equal 4 it's the greatest common factor between two numbers here it will be what it will be 4 choose that are p